<laughs> Hi and welcome to day 21, the final day of 21 days of laughter with Andre Crisp and Portland Laughter Yoga. And <laughs> I have to say, I have been struggling with the second half of this laughter challenge just because of uh, getting sick and then still having the back injury and life happening. I have a computer virus that's going on that I can't seem to get a hold of. <laughs> and this is exactly why I ran this challenge because uh, this uh, daily uh, laughter challenge because I know that I need it um, once life starts to get uh, a little too crazy and intense it's really easy for me to fall let the laughter practice fall to the wayside and I can definitely tell the difference when I don't do it um, because those those day-to-day -day, uh, things that just happen in our lives tend to get to me a lot more um, and take me off my equilibrium uh, much easier than they do when I when I stick with doing the laughter practice so thanks for sticking with me through the ups and downs and uh, me being sick and not getting the videos up uh, quite fast enough sometimes because of that um, thank you so much and uh, <laughs> I'm ready to laugh um, this shirt was actually a, a gift from uh, my good friend Christine and if you've been watching the videos um, I had a laughter box that was also a gift that she's given me over the years she's a great gift giver thank you so much Christine and uh, Dan and I were actually able to take it apart and replace the batteries and so guess what <laughs> this is the box of audience laughter so this is like the old-fashioned audience laughter for sitcoms <laughs> and it's light activated when the batteries work. Uh, the batteries just needed to be replaced, but we had to take the screws out and get down inside here. <laughs> but I just absolutely love this thing. I leave it in the living room for people to discover. <laughs> Thank you, thank you, thank you for that because that's something that I've gotten uh, lots of laughs and joy out of over the years. And uh, now that we know the batteries can be replaced, we're going to get lots more laughter for years to come. <laughs> Canned audience laughter. That also reminds me of an exercise that uh, the way I was taught it was pocket laughter. Um, because it's like you have your your smile or your laugh in your pocket. And I think I kind of did this uh, in some of the, the videos, but not actually with explaining it. So when you do this at club, the leader is the person who uh, has all of the power of whether it's time to laugh or not. Um, and so they're going to take the, the laughter and smiles out of their pocket and put it on their face. <laughs> and it's time to laugh and everybody laughs. <laughs> <laughs> until it gets taken away and put back in the pocket <laughs> oh got a little excited here we have <laughs> hit the hit the desk and the camera and made everything <laughs> gotta love it this is the beauty of uh live recording and not really editing any of it all serious up in here. <laughs> very good. Very good. Yay. Very good. Very good. Yay. 
<laughs> so because of the back injury, I built myself an IKEA hack uh, standing desk for thirteen dollars because I got something on sale. So you can actually do it for fourteen dollars, but <laughs> seriously, very cheap. But uh, it, I have a shelf that sticks out on L brackets um, from a little tiny table from IKEA that has my keyboard so that I can stand up. Um, because sitting is what uh, is really hard to do with my lower back uh, and disc injury. So, um, and because it's just a cheap little table from Ikea, I can just pick the whole thing up and put it off to the side of my office. And then I can sit down when I need to sit down at my desk. So, but this is the shelf is what I hit. <laughs> and it makes everything go, Wah! because uh, the monitor and everything is sitting attached to this little Ikea. It's called the Lack Table, which is like a $10 table, and then you get brackets and a little shelf, put it all together, and voila, standing desk. So you can always Google that if you would like to see the instructions. But pretty simple. I did it myself in just like an hour. So very good. Very good. Yay! Very good. Very good. Yay! <laughs> All right, I'm gonna take some nice big deep breaths. I'm gonna move my chair out of the way before I trip on it again, like I did in one of the other videos. <laughs> so I'm starting with my hands uh, a width apart, pretending like I'm holding on to a nice ball of energy. And I'm gonna inhale up to my chest and exhale to the sky, inhale, exhale, push it out, inhale, and exhale down, we'll do that two more times with less talking. down. Final time. Inhale. Exhale. Let me stop giggle. <laughs> Shaking laughter. <laughs> well, I'm shaking my foot down here. You can't see, but we like to do uh, some balance exercises uh, in laughter club <laughs> where we go on one leg and then the other and laugh and shake. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Another one of my favorite. Uh, laughter exercises for helping getting the laughter and the energy moving uh, because I am an EFT practitioner is tapping and laughing. <laughs> getting that thymus point, uh, the top of the head, <laughs> getting the governing meridian. <laughs> 
getting all kinds of good energy moving. Woohoo! <laughs> You go up and down the arms. <laughs> I like to do my wrists as well, front and back. Because <laughs> it gets all kinds of meridians that run down through the fingers and up to the arms and the rest of the body. <sighs> Getting the belly and on the rib cage, off to the side under the arm. <laughs> <laughs> ah, and then you can go up and down your legs. I'm not going to do that because bending over is one of the things that's contraindicated for my back injury. So let's get in the back here my kidneys and adrenals. <laughs> oh. My goodness, I can't believe that it has been 21 days of laughter. Thank you so much for joining me through this 21 days of uh, daily laughter and breathing. And of course, I'm going to continue my practice. I'm not going to continue doing a video necessarily every single day, but I do run this practice, um, this uh, challenge, so to speak. Um, not super frequently, but I do it multiple times, so it will happen again, so stay tuned. And I may just be doing some random uh, videos of me laughing um, that aren't associated necessarily with the challenge that I just share. So stay tuned on the YouTube channel and Facebook. Uh, you can follow me on Portland Laughter Yoga. You can also follow me on Andrea Crisp. I have my own business page, andreacrisp.com on Facebook. Um, where I could possibly be sharing some of the video links as well. And then um, the people who are in the Daily Laughter Challenge Facebook group, of course, I will be sharing videos there as I make them um, and announcing the next time I do a challenge. So thank you so very much. Um, it, it helps knowing that there is actually somewhat some kind of audience on the other side and I'm not just uh, videotaping myself uh, for my own benefit. <laughs> Because that sounds a little nutty. Um, <laughs> so it's nice to know that there's actually some people who are laughing along with me. So thank you so very much uh, for laughing uh, with me, uh, participating, and following along, and for all the comments um, that I got along the way as well. Feel free to add any questions or comments that you might have on the videos on YouTube or in the Facebook group. And I will be seeing you later on another laughter video coming your way anytime soon. 